Hey everybody, Steve here. Hey, this is not about Maxwell drums today. This is a video uh, we're doing about Craviato. It's been a long time since I've done Craviato video, and uh, this is going to be just really fun. There's a lot of great things going on as we move into, believe it or not, the third decade of uh, Craviato's legacy. It's coming up. 2024 begins the, the next 10 years, 20th anniversary. So, uh, some very exciting things that we'd like to talk about here. A uh, number of different topics, one of which, uh, Builder's Choice is a uh, line that we've been experimenting with and we'll be introducing to select dealers. And this is a great, uh, I, I think it's a great product. So we have our master builders down at Craviato in Nashville uh, do their, it's their own take. It's like, like, go ahead, go, go with it. Design what you'd like. So what we've got is a bunch of different woods. You'll find these offerings will have different woods. Some will be more standard, some will be exotics. Uh, we're using different hardware configurations. Some will be tube lugs. Some will be our diamond uh, cast lugs. Some will be our marquee lug. Other things will be different uh, rims, different tension rod colors, styles of rims. Some will be triple flange, brass plated. Some will be uh, die cast. We've got die cast black, die cast gold, die cast uh, pewter silver uh, tinted. There's some great stuff here with a mixture of different strainers. Some will be three point, some will be trick. It'll be great stuff. And these are going to start to be offered out to um, select Craviato dealers pretty soon. So that's great fun. We've also decided we're going to do a lot more content on the YouTube channel. Uh, it's been underutilized, the Craviato YouTube channel. So you're going to see a lot more content up there coming along. And then also we're into, as I mentioned, the 20th anniversary. That's 2024 kicks off the next decade. So we're going to have some very exciting offerings for that that will be available through select Craviato dealers. There will be uh, Craviato, AK Adrian Kirschler, the master of metal shells, as Johnny was the master of solid wood. And we've done these collaborations before. There will be three drums that will be Craviato, AK, three different models. There will only be 20 drums for each model. And each one of those drums will have a specific date on it the serial number will correspond to one of the years of Craviato's 20 years, starting with 2004, ending with 2023. So those will be announced to dealers shortly. Then there will also be, in addition to the Craviato AK, there will be uh, 20 uh, snare drums, two different species, so 40 drums, two different species, uh, exotic woods, which is still to be determined. We're working through some we have in the tank now to see what we'd like to pick. And then there will also be 20 exotic kits, uh, four-piece kits, basically uh, with 18, 20, 22, or 24 bass drum, probably six of the first three and two of the last uh, to make a total of 20 kits. So that's all still in the works, plus there'll be special documentation that goes out with these. We're working all, all of that now. We're also preparing to work on a uh, Craviato 20th anniversary legacy video tribute to Johnny. And this won't be so much, here's a bunch of cool drums to look at, it'll be more of what do people love about Johnny, his legacy and the drums that he made. So uh, we're looking forward to put, putting that together. We've got some pre-production planning meetings uh, with the videographer that we're gonna start doing soon. So that's gonna be a lot of fun. And we'll have people coming in, some of our artists talking about Johnny, some of our uh, dealers <clears throat> talking about Johnny, about what he means to them and, and what, what uh, Craviato means to everybody. So that'll be fun. Uh, now, another big message, Steve Jr. Uh, is taking over as head of dealer relations. So any sales or dealer related activities are going to go straight through him. And this is great because uh, we're going to put a new focus on dealer support in terms of getting info out, more product info out there. Uh, he's also worked hand in hand with the production line folks down in Nashville so he can bring uh, another perspective of, uh, of the Craviato production process to the table. Uh, he's also done a walkthrough video that we're going to uh, list and show for you separately. So there'll be a separate walkthrough video that Steve Jr. did. So we're excited about that. He's going to get in touch with everybody. There'll be a dealer blast going out and then he'll provide his, uh, his email and uh, phone information there so everybody will have it. So we're excited about that. Also in the Illinois store, uh, we've taken another space adjacent to uh, our current shop, 1,000 square feet. It'll be a world-class Craviato showroom in there. It's going to be great. Uh, I was over the, the other day looking at it, and it's coming along just terrific. And should, we should be in there by mid-November. And There'll be a lot of great Craviato stuff in there, museum pieces. We'll do some videos from in there so everybody will get to see it. And, of course, if you come through town, you can come and check it out. Uh, down in Nashville, the production team down there is charging ahead. We've made uh, process and procedure improvements. We've got some new equipment in there that will uh, speed up the drilling process and also make it even more precise, which is great. Uh, we've got a whole bunch of things that we're doing. The idea is to obviously keep the quality control, 
uh, top notch, but get production through a little more quickly, reduce the backlog so we can meet the demand. Uh, so we've got a great team down there. Zach, Saul, Chad, Harry, Ryan, Jonah. I mean, everybody, the whole team, everybody's psyched, and they're really looking forward to getting everything uh, up and running even better for the next decade. So, uh, you know, we're excited to begin the next chapter, basically, what we're telling you here. There's a lot of fun we're going to have here, and there's a, you know, a lot of pride in uh, being able to continue to produce drums in, uh, the, in the way that Johnny did, in the time-honored you know, methods that he uh, fostered and developed and passed on to the people making them today. So it's an honor for us to keep that legacy alive. We're real excited and uh, everybody's looking forward to it. So stay tuned. We'll be sending you more info and uh, we're going to have some fun.